what's up this is Shari and welcome back to my dream lab and if it's your first time here welcome to my dream lab in today's video I'm gonna talk to you about how to develop your chest voice so if that is something that interests you keep on watching so if you don't know your chest voice is the voice that is responsible for your lower notes and it's primarily the voice that you speak in if you have an underdeveloped chest voice that means that you need to develop something called your thyroarytenoid muscle and what this muscle does is it shortens the vocal folds, it also thickens them, and lowers the pitch, okay? So we're going to be doing some exercises that is going to accomplish those goals. First, I want to let you hear what it sounds like if you have an underdeveloped chest voice, okay? So it might sound like this. So there's air in my tone and I'm kind of using my head voice muscles when I'm doing this, right? Ah, ah, right? So if we want to have a developed one, it's going to sound like this. No air in the tone, nice and strong. Ah, ah, ah. To develop your chest voice okay in order to develop your chest voice you like I said are gonna want to develop your TA muscle and you want to engage some subglottic pressure which can be accomplished through glottal stops now these exercises can be kind of harsh on your voice so if at any point it hurts I just want you to stop and reach out to a voice teacher who can help you with developing your chest voice okay in a safe way but we're gonna start on an ah okay not too hard like if we were to say apple okay so we're gonna go so you're kind of holding your breath back right you're not letting your breath out you're not going that's not what we want we want now if that is too harsh, we can put a B in front of it, okay? We can go ba 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 I like to tell my students to make it sound ugly. So let's do, I'm gonna give you the choice. You can do an A or just or a B, and we're gonna do an exercise. Here we go. Ba 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 exercise is elong elongating that exercise so connecting it and making it more legato so we're gonna either go ah notice there's not air in the tone I'm not going ah, ah, and if you want put a B in front of it on a song right so I have a song it goes um used to want it so bad falling in love was always a part of the plan now singing it brightly would sound like used to want it so bad falling in love was always a part of the plan and that's just not enough that's too much air going through okay so if I were to practice these tips using a song I would go ba 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 right and so that is the way that I would work on it and then I would I would work on the words used to want it so bad falling in love was always a part of the plan okay and that's right in the range of of your chest voice 
So that is it. I really hope that you found this video to be helpful. If you did, do me a favor and click that thumbs up button. And also, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe and don't forget to click that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I put out a video. If you are already a subscriber, thank you, thank you, thank you so, so much. And if you have not downloaded my free warm-up guide, do that. You can download it. It's in the, um, what is it called? It's in the description box below. All right, I am signing out. Thank you for watching and keep dreaming with your eyes wide open. Bye. Sometimes I just feel like I can touch the sky.